All right, we are at a stream in Colombia where we find the, the Pistograma alacrina. I'm seeing a lot of really cool fish in here. I'm gonna get as much video as I can. Unfortunately, the water is a little off color because we have had some rain, but I think it's gonna be clear enough that we're gonna be able to see the fish. And we've already seen from the surface some Pistograma with fry and some other species we haven't seen yet. So I'm really excited about this spot. Ted's Fish Room presents Columbia 2016, sponsored by Amazonas Magazine, Rapashi Superfoods, and SwissTropicals.com. The plan for this day is to drive south out of Via Vicencio into an area along the edge of the mountains where a Pistogramma alacrina can be found. We got an early start on the day, but it is raining. Our distant goal is the village of Mesitas, where the road crosses a bridge over the Rio Wehar, a bigger river with some interesting fish. We are a bit concerned that the overnight rain may have blown out the river, but it is quite some way south and it is hard to predict whether the rain here affected the river there. The drive passes through more of the beautiful Llanos grassland along the eastern edge of the Andes Mountains. We cross a few rivers that are flowing high and muddy. This is not a good sign. I do manage to add several birds to my life list on this trip, including this awesome Cocoe Heron. This is a chestnut-eared aracari, the first toucan type I've seen on the trip. And these interesting birds of prey are savanna hawks that use their long legs to hunt on the ground. After about a two hour drive with stops, we reach the Rio Rajar and we find it high and muddy. Not good conditions to see fish. Kawa. On to plan B. The stop is not a total loss, I do find these really cool ants. Ants are everywhere in Colombia, and you really have to be careful where you stand for too long and where you sit your stuff down. Sponge filters are the choice of serious aquarists in their fish rooms because they are inexpensive and effective. The biggest mistake a fish keeper can make is to assume that there is no technical advantage to one type of filter over another. Parade filter foams are superior to other foams which will eventually break down in an aquarium. I have Parade foam filters from Swiss Tropicals that have been in constant use in my fish room for a decade. Swiss Tropicals is the exclusive distributor of Parade foam in North America and a supplier of other high quality aquarium products. Visit SwissTropicals.com today and learn more about the aquarium filters that the experts use. Amazonas, the world's favorite aquarium magazine. Amazonas is one of the world's legendary tropical fish publications, read by tens of thousands of enthusiasts who are passionate about keeping fascinating and thriving freshwater aquariums. Every issue brings rare fish husbandry and breeding, world-class aquarium systems, freshwater aquarium advice, and thought-provoking news and much, much more. Stay inspired, stay informed, and stay connected to the world's most passionate aquarium keepers. Subscribe to the world's favorite aquarium magazine, Amazonas. The Rio Wehar is a bust, and it is the distant point on our trip, so now we retrace our route back towards Via Vicencio, stopping at some smaller streams that we scouted along the way that look better for seeing fish. The first stop is at a small stream just outside the town of San Juan de Arama, a name I recognize from a Pistogramma Alacrino collection reports. And as it turns out, this is an awesome place to see fish.
find a lot of Epistogramma alacrina, including this female with a huge number of fry. We also discover a secret in a pile of sunken brush, a pair of Crinocycla species pike cichlids also guarding a large brood. I work my way upstream filming so that the water I am wading into is always clear. Alessandro works behind me catching fish. This stream is too small and rocky for the seine, so he is catching fish with his large hand net, one at a time. Here is one of the male Episto alacrina he was able to net. We have seen a lot of cool fish at this location, but we need to move on. There are other stops to make before we head back in for the night. Don't miss an episode of Columbia 2016. Please subscribe to my channel and help spread the word by sharing this video with your friends. Thank you for watching Ted's Fish Room and please check out my sponsors for this series, Rapashi Superfoods, SwissTropicals.com and Amazonas Magazine.